Yo. What's up, everybody? Where are we at? Did I finally... Did we beat whoever... Like, I wasn't... Okay. No. I, I don't know. Looks like there's a resource reading. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Are you all right? Are you with Kasane Platoon? Everything should be fine now that you're here. Don't talk. You're wounded badly. I'll fix you up as best I can. I don't know why I'm we're okay, here. But you have to help my teammates first. The truck is still under attack. Oh yeah, it's distress. Another, it, but it was human. Those Suo bastards transformed someone into an other and... <laughs> transformed into another. This is a critical mission. You have to protect the truck and get it to the Supernatural Life Research Facility. <sighs> this is valuable information. Wait here for rescue. We'll take care of everything. Haruka! I've oh. already requested a rescue team. The Supernatural Life Research Facility? Isn't that the lab Naomi was in? Let's hurry. They won't get away with turning people into others. Oh. I wasn't going to go rush off on my own again. Are we all on board? Mm, okay. I hate to agree, but I'm all for hurrying. Thank you, Sheedan. No need for thanks. Now come on, or I'm gonna leave you behind. Kasane is finally showing her vulnerable side. Or maybe she's just expanded her horizons. Yeah, I'm a little surprised too. <laughs> I'm so happy we're all getting along. Now, let's go help the transport team. I think we're all getting along, except for the Check whole Kiro Yu Ito thing. No, I don't have to like. A normal transport truck. Oh, I can't take a picture in here. So sorry y'all, but I've learned I need to take a whole lot more pictures. Cause I was trying to do some thumbnails and that must be the truck. Things were I don't see up. any members of the transport team. Hey look, by the truck there. There's someone there. They're hitting it with a stick or something. This is a damn sturdy door. Can't even hack it. Just break it down already. My arms are getting tired. Hmm. Is that Kodama? What are you doing? Well, if it isn't the traitors. How have you been? Hmm? Why do you look so scared? Kodama, did you turn someone into an other and make them attack this transport team? I mean, this was headed for the Seiron Research Facility. I figured it had to have something important. You're trying to find out what they're researching by digging through their cargo? I swear your methods are insane. Who's it's the, the fastest on? way. So anyway, can you let me go just this once? Pretty please? Yeah, I don't think so. That's too bad. Well, I guess we're doing this. Who is she anyways? What is her power? Don't get mad at me when I kill you. This'll be fun. I don't. Turning people into others. How what is her power? So Oh, don't you. get so angry. I meant well. I'll bring you. Please, Joker. Is it sound? I don't know what those are made of. But, yo, I really can't tell what her power is. Is that sound? Let me I don't think that double is. Sorry. Yeah, I got it. I'm gonna try to be faster though. What? 
It's not duplication. Is this a transformation ability? There's no sign of her using SAS. <laughs> Were you surprised by Master Kodama's secret? I never showed anyone before. Oh well, it doesn't matter since you're all dying here anyway. Bro, leave a comment. Let me know if you... Because I'm doing it with no Google. That's why. So let me know if you know her power or anything offhand without Google search. I can't tell what's happening. I mean, I know the transformation, but I can't tell as far. Oh, I can't tell as far as uh. Like her, her uh, slashes and stuff. Like I know Nagi. Power. I'll support you. The only person who can use multiple powers is Major General Karn, the Brain Eater. What does that mean? Damn. That's really fishy. There's a weakened member. Yeah. Um. Oh yeah, in uh, Yuito's run through, he doesn't fight her. I think, I think there is like an, another person. No, it's Nagi. Yeah, he fights Nagi. So yeah, so I'm like, I have no, I don't even know who Katana is. I think she was with Karen at first, maybe, or the other guy. I don't know. Use it well. I think, yeah, we're just gonna play baseball so she has that. Alright, gang. Don't underestimate me. I don't know what I'm gonna if y'all knew what it was like to try and make a thumbnail for these hey, videos, you'd understand. Not bad. You're a lot stronger than before. You all deserve a nice round of applause. Kodama, throw down your weapon and don't make any sudden movements. We have a lot of questions for you. Well, you do have me surrounded. I don't think I'm getting out of this one. Just kidding. What? You expected I wouldn't have a plan? What? <laughs> bye bye now. Looks like she got away. At least the truck seems fine. Do you want to escort it back to the facility then? Hmm. It did seem like it was an important mission from what the transport team member said. Maybe we should. Then I'll contact the superiors about the suppression assignment. Wait. I'm getting a reading nearby. It's not the Seiron OSF. It could be more of Kodama's men. Mm. Well, we obviously don't want anyone following the truck. So I'll go check it out and stop them here if it comes to that. Oh, I'm definitely tagging along, Major Kyoka. If it's an ambush, then I'm just the man for the job. It's my specialty. Mm -hmm. Arashi, please get this truck back to the Supernatural Life Research Facility. And it's go time. Good luck, kids. Weren't we supposed to discuss things first? Let it go. Anyway, we'll leave that to Kyoka and Kagero. We have a truck to transport. Does it still run? Sure does. It's got a few scrapes, but nothing serious. Luckily, you can pick it up. The truck bed's reinforced armor is full of dents. And Kodama did all this with just a metal pipe. Unbelievable. It's just stupid how incredibly strong she is. Hmm. I don't know her. I might look it up. Who knows? Where have you been? Hurry up and unload the truck. I need to go get the lab ready. Great. Now they're making us do manual labor, too? This is turning out to be more of a pain than I thought. Haruka, any word from Kyoka or Kagero? Not yet. 
It's hard to get a good signal to Mizuhagawa. I think it's because of the extinction belt above. I see. Then let's get this over with. I'm kind of happy. Can you all hear me? <clears throat> Great, they didn't you're make all right. Me fight all the way there. What about Kagero? You know me. I normally say I'm ship shape, but we've actually found ourselves in a tight spot. It wasn't Kodama's men in Mizuhagawa. It was Yuito Platoon, and they noticed the truck. Yuito Platoon? Did you two... Yes. We couldn't have anyone following the truck. So we did what we had to do, which was fight them. It was only to buy some time, though. Then we used Major Kyoka's duplication and my invisibility to lose them. Which is how the story would go in a perfect world, but they've got Sugumi's eyes on their side. Ah, her clairvoyance. We can't let our guards down. We'll try to rendezvous back with you after we throw them off our trail. You should still be careful, though. Copy that. Contact us if anything happens. Sorry, guys. Due to the extinction belt, I can't track Yuito Platoon. Man. Well, there's nothing we can really do about that. <clears throat> we just have to finish this annoying work first. I can't wait to play as Yuito. We managed to get one truck unloaded. They all look like the same boxes. <sighs> Shiden, what's wrong? Are you tired? What? No, I'm not tired. I was just curious what this cargo was. That's it. Damn. What are you doing? You can't unlock private cargo just because you're curious. No, it just unlocked on its own. What is it? Did you find an other inside or something? Look. Hmm? What is it? Th this is... A human head? Damn. This one too. All of these cases, they're filled with heads. What are they going to use them for? Wait. Food? Naomi said she takes the medication in the ampules. These are probably used to research the other weapons. Or maybe... No, I shouldn't be tossing around any theories at this point. So, basically, these human heads are being transported from Togetsu? That researcher mentioned getting the lab ready. We might be able to find something if we search the facility. We're not done unloading the truck, but I can't stop thinking about this. Let's go check out where he went. Mm. Alright. It'll be bad if Yuito finds this location. Will we have to fight them too? Yes. We don't have a choice. Hopefully, Kyoka handles it so we don't have to do that. But she probably won't, so. <laughs> Bro, I can't wait to play as Yuito again, dog. Like, his playthrough, like, I don't know. I think I like the, um, the whole, yeah, there's no reason to fight through everybody. Again. I think I like the whole, um, you know, not following rules and figuring out the story on the dark side. Because Yuito plays through the dark side. I mean, you know, he's not in a group. He's wanted, so. But I do think they doing my boy Yuito wrong though. Hmm. Do I? I don't think I have these. stuff I can go get but I'm not gonna do that to y'all really do hate this place the stench is just awful I was right it can't be oh it definitely is 
Others feed on human brains, and this facility houses others, and... Ampules! How could... these ampules... but that means Naomi... Intruders were just detected coming in from the facility's rear entrance. <coughs> I've also received an update on our assignment from Seiron. The intruders are Yuito Sumeragi and New Himuka OSF members, and we are to eliminate them, no matter what. Oh, never mind. They belong to New Himuka. Of course Himuka. they come now. Seems like Seiron really wants Yuito dead. They must be desperate to eliminate the threat the Kunad Gate poses. Eliminate them. What are you going to do, Kasane? We should kill him. To save the world. But I know I haven't been listening to anyone else. So maybe Yuito wants to talk to me, like all of you did. Jesus Wait, Christ. one more thing. If we refuse this assignment, they said they would dispose of the research subjects in order to bury the evidence. <sighs> so they're taking Naomi as a hostage. Duh. Yeah. And knowing that Naomi is your one soft spot, I probably would have done the same if I were them. But can they really do that? She's still an important research subject to them and there's no way Major General Karin would let them he didn't want Yuito to be assassinated that may be true but that still doesn't prove that Karin would protect Naomi although I can't picture him treating human born others like mere objects either mm. however this assignment came to us officially which means there's a chance it came with Karin's approval they could also be bluffing what's important isn't whether or not they're bluffing it's how certain we are they won't harm Naomi. That's... And it doesn't help that we've already failed one assassination attempt. This response seems natural if they suspect we have ulterior motives. It's not like we can break Naomi out and take her with us. Does that mean we have no other choice but to fight Yuito? Yes. Hmm. Let's hide. Are you serious? Naomi is in danger! I know, but fighting them out in the open wouldn't be smart. We should hide in the next area and ambush them. That would give us an excuse to leave here and would buy us some time to think. Haruka, report our plan to them. We'll lie and wait for the intruders and stand by for an opportunity to attack. Copy that. Good luck. I think her brother is their um, communications person, too. So, I don't know. I forget how they handle everything, but I hope their family's not, you know, being. Yuito all, Platoon is whatever. headed to the factory block as predicted. They this will arrive in 30 work. seconds. We've been ordered to send the control system data to Seiron after we make contact with Yuito. In other words, they'll be monitoring your conversation. Be careful. Understood. Yuito Platoon arriving in five, four, three. Hey, what buddy. is this facility? It looks like some sort of assembly line. Hey, those boxes. Aren't they the same ones from that transport truck we saw? <laughs> what is it, Sugumi? Does it contain what I brought earlier? A human head. You've got to be kidding me. All of these? What in the world is this place? I don't know. It's kind of crazy, actually. Oh, I actually do know. Well, Yuito. Oh, shit. No. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. This is the other's facility. What do you want to do? Have you gotten your thoughts together yet? There are no thoughts to get together. I don't have a choice. It's only an issue of resolve. So, we have to fight. That's our assignment. You could lose. Besides, if we let Yuito leave now, the public will find out about this place and the ampules. Then they might stop all the research. What would become of Naomi if that happened? Either way, our only choice is to kill Yuito. Have you thought about what the ampules contain? Of course I have. But to be honest, just thinking about it won't solve anything. Well, we have your answer. Just listen to yourself. We should just tell them everything. Yuito will understand. He's way too forgiving. We should take advantage of that. And then what? 
that would mean going against Seiron. If you have a way to save Naomi, then tell me. I never said... Okay, calm down, you two. What about fighting to a draw? We can just tell Seiron that we had to be careful we didn't damage this very important facility. Or something along those lines. Knowing the strength of Yuito Platoon, we should be able to convince the government that we tried our best, but couldn't beat them. However, they would get suspicious if they completely overpowered us. We'll have to fight like we mean it. This is the best idea I've got. Hmm, I can go along with that. Okay. That's fine with me, too. Guys, you need to make contact with Yuito Platoon soon. Let's go. Seiron will start to get suspicious if we wait any longer. Those ampules! I think I'm going to be sick. Sorry. This can't be real, right? Those were made by Spring Pharmaceuticals. Hey! What's up, buddy? Damn it! Looks like Kyoka couldn't lose you. What is this? I don't know. It's a other facility where Naomi is, so we kind of have to keep it <clears throat> a thing, you know. But honestly, God, I could care less. We need to give up on Naomi. Sorry. I think you've already figured it out. This is Spring Pharmaceutical Seiron Factory. To be more accurate, it's an other research facility they run jointly with the Seiron government. They're using these heads to make their products. <sighs> Shiden, stay calm. Just concentrate on stopping Yuito. Wait, let's talk. Hey! First you were trying to kill me. Now you're trying to hide this cool place? Don't you feel anything seeing what's going on here? What are you all thinking? No. <sighs> okay, Genma, I think it's you first, maybe? I thought you were amazing since you were a cadet, Kasani. Uh, but now you're trying to kill Yuito and trying to hide this facility? Sorry. What happened to you? This isn't like you. Uh, I'm off. Sorry. Time to fight back. <laughs> Rid of it. Wait, what happened? You ugly mother. You don't know anything about anything. Then tell us. We don't know anything because you won't tell us anything. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. I think I was kind of annoyed by like how innocent, how innocent he actually was. But he has a good heart. That's why I'm. Uh, you know, he has a good, good heart. And he actually communicates everything instead of like the sign. But we, everybody's different. You can't expect people just to, you know, be the way you are. Your view is accepting or it's good things. Start. I gotta be more understanding of that. Even though I still think you know it's better. <laughs> Whoa, buddy. It sucks. I'm not paying you any attention. Are you using it? No. Give it to me, Arashi. I don't have a choice. Sorry. Oh my god. Yumito, can you uh do me a favor and leave me the hell alone? Jesus Christ. Uh let's try this. Sorry. Oh, thank you for getting this. All right. Well, where is the troublemaker? There he is. Done, youngster. I like how like me and her doing the same time. Like, I can see her moving and everything. Let's go. I'm 
bro, I, man, I still haven't figured out how to take them damn tips off the screen. Leave a comment if it's simple or not. That's a huge possibility. Have a well, I don't. You can tell. It's still up there. Okay. There he is. Right. Come on, we need some more stuff to throw at him. There we go. Gotta hit him with the tentacles. Okay. Damn, I was hoping he was gonna do this. Well, everybody run for 40 seconds. Brother, sorry, you ain't gonna get me. We need to print this story is too long for me to just keep losing. So, do you? Cause you just got, got smacked upside the damn head with um one of these things. Bench. Like, how dead is she? I can't use nothing else. Hey, get away from me. We can't give up. Oh well, you know what? Whatever. Alright. I wanna revive him. Show me what you got. It's up to you. I need to stop using that ball. You want a 1v1? Damn it, this is taking too long, actually. <laughs> they gotta come back. This is taking too long. Support you. Give it to me, Arashi. Why? I don't have a choice. I'm out of it already. Bruh. Making drugs out of human heads is crazy. We have to stop them. I don't know what just happened. But Naomi, she needs this. What do you mean? What is this facility for? That's. You are not authorized to divulge any more information. Are you the government official from before? I'm sorry, I was ordered to patch him through. Please focus on eliminating the target. We promise you fair compensation for your efforts. By compensation, you do mean Naomi's safety, correct? I want a clear answer that'll stay on the OSF transmission record. Hmm. Well, well, why aren't you answering? My bet is because you made this call on your own without Major General Karin's permission. There has been a change in plans. I am canceling your assignment. Await your next orders. Communication with Ceyron has been disconnected. We're not being monitored anymore. Hmm. I can't take this anymore. I'm telling them everything. <laughs> no, I will. This place is an other research facility run jointly with Spring Pharmaceuticals, just like Arashi said. Human brains of people with powers are being brought here. A portion of them are transplanted into others to turn them into other weapons. The rest are turned into a medical solution to feed the others. That's horrible. Hey, are you really sure about Ceyron? I know New Himuka has a lot of its own issues. It's not right that the government monitors everyone and controls all the information. But Ceyron causing the uprising, that's just as messed up. Can we really let them get away with transplanting human brains into others or processing the brains into drugs? 
No, we can't, obviously. That being said, there are, in fact, some people who've been forced to accept it. Like my brother. And then there's Kasane. People whose loved ones have been turned into others. They depend on that medication. Human-born others can temporarily regain their senses when they take that medication. Even letting them talk. Does Karin have a family member that's been metamorphosed? No, not a family member. As Luca or Fabuki mentioned it. Alice? <laughs> Yuito! His brain is... <laughs> Yuito! Yuito? <sighs> Are you okay? What's wrong? You look like you're in pain. There's something wrong with Yuito's brain. He's beginning to show signs of speech and memory impairment whenever he uses his power. I'm okay now. The pain is fading. Sorry to interrupt, but you need to leave now so we can call this a draw. Hurry up, or the others will come. We should leave too. That okay with you, Kasane? Yes. I'm sorry. I heard from Haruka. It seems like a lot happened while we were gone. If Yuito and his team left, shouldn't we be checking on a certain someone? That's right. Naomi! I'm coming, Naomi! Naomi! Great. We'll go check and see how Naomi's doing. What about you guys? Where are you? We're close by, so let's meet up at Naomi's room. <laughs> this is the first I've heard there was a communications log. Very observant. That was just a bluff. Luckily, it fooled them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 200 meters, what? Oh wait, I use a lot of medium all. Hopefully. Let's hope I don't have to fight. These are medium all. They're all medium. Oh. Still worth it. I was like, who was that for a second? Uh, that was really 200? No. were made from human brains. So, you found out. I heard a researcher. She said that Yuito and his team saw the heads. Calm down, Naomi. I can't do this anymore. If I had known it came from human brains, I would have told them no. It's a cruel reality. But without these drugs, it wouldn't be possible to talk with you like this. Yes, I know. It's not true. You're still you. <laughs> Thank you. But I have to be honest. This is too much for me. I can't do it. I don't want to live if it means other people have to die. Wait. I'll find a way to turn you back. So please don't give up. I'm sorry. Please, I need to be alone. Naomi. You undisciplined rats. I know you can hear me. Get out of Naomi's room now. Major can we fight General him? Karin, you're here at the facility? I'll tell you about the research they do here. Now get out of there so Naomi can calm down. Let's go. I'll be back, Naomi. 
I'm sorry, Kasane. Mm. Yeah, like that was close. We need to go ahead and we let, let her die. Because, like, for real, she turns back into a human when she. P this PTSD? <laughs> no. I'm sorry. So, Sauron isn't as unified as I had thought. Mm, do me a favor, kiss my ass, alright? First, I think you owe us rats an apology for stringing us along through all this. Who owes who now? Huh? I don't care about an apology. Have you found a way to turn Naomi back? If she stays here, she's... Not yet. I'll keep Naomi's psychological well-being in mind, but this facility is the best chance she has. Even if we manage to pacify Naomi, she'll have to continue taking the ampules. They'll be able to do it. Why is Sauron conducting research like this? What are they planning on doing to others using human brains? Can we fight him already? I suppose I should tell you what Sauron and Suo's true motives are. It all comes down to how each city views others and the Extinction Belt. The Extinction Belt? Suo wants to eliminate the Extinction Belt to stop the others. While Sauron believes they need the Extinction Belt. The differing views of the Extinction Belt is the root of Suo and Sauron's conflict. I might not agree with their methods, but I can understand Suo's position. Sauron, on the other hand... Why do they think the Extinction Belt is necessary? That's where the others come from. Sauron is pursuing their counter-other research while avoiding the elimination of the Extinction Belt. Kagero, what do you think would happen if the Extinction Belt disappeared? Um, no idea. Why are you asking me? Never mind. In any case, I don't care about what either side wants. More importantly, Kasane. W what What you did here was reckless. I only did what I could for Naomi. Seiron's threats aren't just a bargaining strategy. Watch what you leak to Yuito, and be careful you don't do anything that would put Naomi in danger. <sighs> <sighs> That's all for now. No, we're not done here. We still have questions. Remember your roles. That will help Naomi more than anything. He looked like he was in a hurry. I wonder if something happened. It's painstakingly obvious that Karin is still hiding information from us. Listen, I'm glad we've they just been through too. a lot. I think we should go back to the hideout and get some rest. Yes. Hold on, Naomi. I promise I'm going to save you. Welcome back, everyone. You've come here as well. I was afraid I might run into that government official if I went back to headquarters. I'm sorry. Forcing the guy's hand by threatening to put him on the record must have put you in an awkward position. His face was beat red. It was hilarious. If I saw him in person, I would have laughed right in his face. I love her. Oh, I would have loved to see that. That bastard totally deserves it. I can't leave Naomi there. I have to hurry and find a way to turn her back. Can I really rely on Karin? You don't look so well. I want to say hey, no, but I don't know. You better not be thinking about running off on your own to save the day again. Nah, you can't. No, don't worry. Nope. I'm not. Karin mentioned that my power was connected in some way to saving my sister. He did mention that, didn't he? Sure didn't make an effort or even care to explain himself, though. I thought with everything that happened at the other research facility, Naomi would be protected if I asked him. But now, I'm not so sure. There's still so much I don't know. That's true. But to be honest, we barely know anything about the others. That laboratory holding Naomi has the most advanced research on them. So, there's something I've been wondering about that place. You know that truck that you escorted? Wasn't it from Togetsu? 
Yes. While there were no records, judging from its route, there's no mistake it came from Togetsu. Considering the cargo it was carrying, I feel like Togetsu must be connected to the other research somehow. <laughs> You're kidding, right? Togetsu is not that kind of place. All right. You're from there and you follow their faith. It's a religious community that worships the moon. I've never even heard them say anything about others. But with all that cargo they're providing, they must be connected in some way or another. Togetsu has a long history and managed to establish a different culture from Suo or Seiron. That alone sets it apart. I think it's safe to assume that they have information that would prove useful to us. I've never actually considered Togetsu before, but you might be onto something given the situation. We might find a clue there that will help Naomi. You're really going there? You won't find much. I can honestly say I don't know of any place less exciting. What do you want to do? Let's go to Togetsu. Let's go. For real? Weren't you even listening? Karin told us not to do anything that had upset Seiron. But I don't fully trust him. If we don't know what he knows or what he's hiding, then we don't have a choice. Then what about Naomi? It might not be a bluff next time. Haruka, I have a favor to ask. Hmm. I'll keep an eye on Seiron and the research facility and contact you if there's any change. Thank you. I owe you one. Well, let's get ready to go to Togetsu. Oh boy, I don't like the way this is going.